students welcome to my channel please subscribe my channel for the more videos today we will see in this video two houses of parliament so let's see the parliament of india representing as it does all political organized shades of public opinion at the national level occupies a preeminent and pivotal position in the country's constitutional setup it has also over the years carved out for itself a unique place in the esteem and affection of the people as the form through which they articulate and realize their grievances and aspirations and seek solutions to their problems the constitution of india provides for a bicameral parliament consisting of the president and the two houses known as the council of states that is rajya sabha and the house of the people that is lok sabha so first we will see about the rajya sabha the rajya sabha is a is to consist of not more than 250 members of this 12 are nominated by the president from amongst person having special knowledge or practical experience in respect to such matters as literature science art or social service the remaining seats are allocated to the various states and union territories roughly in proportion to the population each state is however represented by at least one member the representative of a state are elected by the elected members of the legislative assembly of that state in accordance with the system of proportional representations by means of the single transferable vote the minimum age of for membership of the house is 30 years the rajya sabha was constituted for the first time on 3rd april 1952 and had its first session on 13th may 1952 it is a permanent body and is not subject to dissolution but one third of its member retires every second year by rotation and are replaced by newly elected members the term of an individual member of rajya sabha is 6 years rajya sabha at present consists of 245 members in which 233 represent the state states and union territories and 12 are nominated members the distribution of seats among the state is as these are the different distribution of the seats among the different states for example andhra pradesh 18 arunachal pradesh 1 assam 7 bihar 16 chatisgarh 5 goa 1 Jammu and Kashmir 4, Jharkhand 6, Kerala 9, Haryana 5, Himachal Pradesh 3, Karnataka 12, Madhya Pradesh 11 and Gujarat 11. Remaining are Rajasthan 10, Sikkim 1, Tamil Nadu 18, Tripura 1, Uttarakhand 3, Uttar Pradesh 31, Maharashtra 19, Delhi 3, Nagaland 1, Manipur 1, Meghalaya 1, Mizoram 1, Odisha 10, Punjab 7. West Bengal 16 The next is Lok Sabha The Lok Sabha is composed of representatives of the people chosen by direct election on the basis of adult suffrage The maximum strength of the house envisaged by the constitution is 552 up to 530 members to represent the states up to 20 members to represent the union territories and not more than 2 members of the anglo indian communities to be nominated by the president of india if the president is of opinion that the community is not adequately represented in the house the total elected elective membership is distributed among the states in such a manner that the ratio between the number of seats allotted to each state and the population of the state is so far as practicable the same for all states the qualifying age for membership of the lok sabha is 25 years the lok sabha unless sooner dissolved continues for 5 years from the date appointed for its first meeting and the expiration 
duration of the period of five years operates at dissolution of the house. However, while a procumulation of an emergency is an operation, this period may be extended by the parliament by law for a period not extending one year at the time and not extending in e any case beyond a period of six months after the proclamation has ceased to operate. Following the first elect general election held in the country in 1952, the first Lok Sabha was constituted on 17th April 1952 and met on 13th May 1952. The first general election held in the country in 1952. The first Lok Sabha was constituted on 17th April 1952 and met on 13th May 1952. The Lok Sabha at present consists of 545 members including two nominated members. The distribution of seats among the state is as Andhra Pradesh 42, Anachar Pradesh 2, Assam 14, Bihar 40, Chhattisgarh 11, Goa 2. Gujarat 26, Haryana 10, Himachal Pradesh 4, Pondicherry 1, Jammu and Kashmir 6, Jharkhand 14, Karnataka 28, Kerala 20, Madhya Pradesh 29. Daman and Dew 1, Maharashtra 48, Manipur 2, Meghalaya 2, Mishwaram 1, Nagaland 1, Odisha 21, Delhi 7, Chhattisgarh 1, Punjab 13, Rajasthan 25, Sikkim 1, Indivan Nicobar Island 1, Lakshadweep 1, Tamil Nadu 39, Tripura 2, Uttarakhand 5, Uttar Pradesh 18, West Bengal 42, Dadar and Nagar Haveli 1. This was the information about the Rajya Sabha and the Lok Sabha, that is the two houses of the parliament. I hope you liked my video. Thanks for watching. Thank you.